Okay, this is a quick tutorial to show students how to upload their assignments onto Moodle. This will be uploading an assignment like a Word document or a PowerPoint or an Excel or anything similar. As you'll see in this sample a Moodle course here, we have a variety of assignments available. We have a group poster, we have uh, words that, that you will get for missed assignments and what a student will do in case of missed assignments. Then we have a series of online quizzes and indeed a discussion forum based on the assignments. In this short screencast, we're going to concentrate, as I said, on uploading possibly a Word document to, um, to Moodle as an assignment. So we'll click on, on this icon here, Group Poster 2. We know it submits a, uh, a document as part of the assignment because of this icon that's here. It's like a, a hand with a page in it. So when the student clicks on this, <clears throat> they will get the description about the assignment. In this case, several topics are available. So when the student clicks here, it gives a, a list of a uh, variety of topics underneath what's called a choice activity in Moodle. That's something we'll talk about later on. And uh, then it tells them to use this particular template, and that's a PowerPoint template that's uh, uploaded previously by the lecture. Here we have the uh, available date from uh, and to, and you'll see here it's well within the time frame for us to do it. It says to, it tells the student, Moodle tells the student there's no file submitted as yet, and then gives the option to upload a file. So simply by clicking on the browse button, you're brought to my computer, and let's just take um, this particular <clears throat> bandwidth document as a thing but you can browse through your computer in the normal fashion to find your document you click upload this file and then just as you wait for your server when your server is ready there you'll see that there's the bandwidth document that's in there the student has the choice now to delete that document by pressing the x button or indeed send it for marking they can, and this, the, the lecturer has m made an option for several files to be submitted at once. For example, two or three Word documents or a Word document and a PowerPoint file. And that limit of number of files is set by the lecturer when designing the assessment. The student now just decides to send for marking. And there we go. Once the assignment is sent for marking, you will no longer be able to delete or attach files. Do you want to continue? Yes, and there we go, it's submitted. All right, and you get a message saying it was already submitted and cannot be uh, updated. If you chose not to, to continue there in the previous slide, uh, the file will be uploaded, but it will allow you to, to um, change it for a more recent draft if needs be. And that's as simple as it is to upload your assignments.